everybody welcome to my craft room thank you for joining me today today's video is part of the collaboration which is hosted by donna who is little spaceman paper crafts over on youtube um, it's the second one we do we upload on the first of every month and it's called a three in one collab i'll just run over briefly what it involves um, each month donna gives us three things that we can use to make our project with this month it's die cuts, it's gems and it's a colouring medium. You can use your staples like your glues, um, your tapes, your stamps, your pattern paper. Um, they're sort of your staples that you can use every month. Okay, so I'm going to share a card with you today. So I'm starting off. I've got all my bits and pieces here at the side of me. I'm going to start off. I've cut myself some flowers. So I'm just going to get the white bits of my flowers. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put a little bit of my Distress Oxide Black Soft. I'm going to spritz with my spritzer just to activate the oxide. And I'm just going to rub my flowers just to colour it slightly. Okay, so I'm just going to pop on my heat gun. Okay, so I've just subtly put a little bit of that black soot on my leaves and my flowers. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to bring in my card. Okay, so I've cut myself a dragonfly with this black cardstock. I've cut myself a tag. I'll show you all the dyes that I've used. The flowers are these here. The tags are these here. The leaves are creative expressions ones those there i've used quite a few different ones today and then i've got the dragonfly which is an apple blossom die so i'm going to start just on my little tag okay and i've got myself a little butterfly stamp and it's just from this do crafts stamp set here and i've just got it on a little stamp block and i'm just going to put some of this butterfly just in the background on my tag i'm just going to use a little stamping block I'm just going to go all over yes I'll leave a list a description to everybody that's taking part in the collaboration I'm just going to put my heat gun on and just dry off that ink Okay, so I'm going to start putting my card together. I've gone for a nice, clean and simple card today. I'm just using black and white. I've got a piece of this pattern paper here. This is a Kanban paper that um, I found in my stash. Okay, and I have left a small border around all four sides. So I'm just going to make sure I've lined up nicely i just try and use the markings on my craft mat okay so i'm going to start with my leaves first i'm just going to run my die cut through it okay so that's going to sit just down there just takes a minute for this tacky glue to grab okay so i'm going to put the glue I die cut through the glue again. This is just a good little tip if you're um, if you're working with sort of intricate die cuts, it just saves trying to sit there and putting glue on each individual leaf. Leaf. Just put a little bit on that one there. I'm just going to cut down this one just a little bit. It's a bit too long. I'm just going to use. Just this bit here. So again, I'm going to put that through my my glue, and I'm just going to sit that one just down there. Okay, so I'm going to start putting my flowers together. So the flat dies that I showed you, you get sort of the base, and then you get your little bit to go on the top. I'm 
going to use some little foam pads to stick on my flowers. I'm going to go my big one just there. Okay, just going to sit my little one there. And then I've got my dragonfly that's going to sit in that top corner up there. Make sure it's all covered. And I'm just going to sit that just in that corner up there. Okay, so next I'm going to stamp my sentiment and I'm just using this stamp set here. I'm just going to bring in my stamp perfect and I've got my stamp. I'm just going to pop that down. I'm going to pick it up. And I'm going to stamp down. Okay, so I'm just going to dry that ink. And I'm just going to use a pair of these fancy edge scissors I'm just going to cut round my sentiment okay so I'm going to sit this onto just a piece of black cardstock and then I'm just going to cut around the black And again, I'm just going to cut around, just leaving a smallish border. So that's just going to sit across the centre of my tag there. And then to finish off, I'm going to use my gems. And I've just chosen some little black and silver ones here. I'm just going to sit a couple inside my flowers. I'm just going to put a little bit of glue on there. Just put a few down there and then I'm just going to stick a couple just onto my background. Okay then guys, so there's my little project for the collaboration. As I said earlier, I'll leave all the links of the other people that have taken part in my description. So any questions, please feel free to contact me. And I do hope you go on and watch the other people's videos. It would be lovely to show some support. So thank you for watching guys. Take care. Bye.